Hi, it's your Uncle Steve with a minute of pain brought to you by More Than Exercise and MoreThanExercise.com. I'm going to talk to uh, you regular folks out there, but I'm also talking to you fitness professionals. One of the things that I've seen lately a lot of is a lot of information regarding certain aspects of health and fitness that just uh, they kind of aren't true. They're old thinking or misguided thinking, that kind of thing. So I'm going to do a little series of uh, videos and try to clear that up. The first one is water consumption. All right, I'm really, it, it bugs me to death when I hear fitness pros telling people to drink so much dang water. You don't need to do that. People are really not dehydrated to the level that, that you as a fitness pro or you as an individual might think. The danger in not using your thirst to guide you on drinking water. When you're thirsty, drink water. Look at, look at deer in the woods. Look at dogs. They When they get thirsty, they go get a drink. They don't carry around a bottle with them everywhere they go. So use your thirst as a guide. And the danger in not doing that is running the risk of what's called hyponatremia or diluting your your uh, sodium levels in your body because of your oversaturation of water. It's easy to do. It's easy also when you take a drink of water, add a little sea salt or a little, uh, my friend's uh, my med solutions. I'll post a link down below. You can look at it, but just replenish the electrolytes that you lose in daily activities, breathing, urinating, sweating, that kind of thing. If you don't do that, you run the risk of overhydration. You know, there's really not been an incident that anyone can remember that I can find of a marathon runner dying of dehydration during a race. But since 1993, at least five people have died of overhydration. So the bigger problem is drinking too much water. Stop drinking so much water. Stop telling people to drink so much water. It's really not that beneficial to you. You may think it is, but it's not. You're not doing yourself a service if you're not replenishing those electrolytes that you're, you, you're losing by drinking just water alone. So if you, if you are going to drink water, whatever liquid you're going to drink, put some electrolytes in them. You can find them, like I said, at the link that I'm posting below. And use your thirst as a guide, not just somebody telling you to drink so much water just for the benefit of drinking water. Now you think about that.